As the game continues in Paris, a Tampa man has developed an innovative technique to prepare Olympic and other athletes for competition. For him, it's about the brain, not the brawn. He is one of hundreds of Team USA athletes in Paris, a world-class canoeist and a four-time Olympian. For Casey Eichfeld, preparing for the world's biggest stage includes more than the physical mechanics of navigating a whitewater course. With Casey, I made him uh, a lot more efficient. Tampa's Tom Maloney has worked with Casey and other athletes in seven straight Olympics to prepare them mentally for competition. The yips is here, and this is the cerebellum. I would call it neuroplasticity. I'm, I'm teaching them how to rewire their brains. Maloney says not preparing your mind is like paddling upstream. You don't want to force your body, you want to control it. You first just learn how to make your body feel like it's floating. And then once we make that connection, now we're gonna make it feel like power. Maloney works to calm the brain and create smoother pathways and patterns to success. Our brain loves patterns. When you get up in the morning, you do the same thing every single day. Teaching athletes how to focus, block pain, and eliminate distractions that lead to failure. When an archer draws his bow, they don't look at what they don't want to hit. They look only at what they want to hit. And so that's what I'm teaching them in practice is to start focusing on the target. Stop worrying about what could happen. Team USA's Casey Eichfeld says Maloney's techniques work for him. He's been really coaching me in, in how to, to maintain my focus and and, uh, and I think that's one of the reasons that I've had a huge jump. As the games continue in Paris, Maloney watches from his home in Tampa, rooting on Team USA, determined to help athletes and all of us become our best. And there's so, so many areas that the, in the brain that we're, we can tap into that are, I wouldn't say superhuman, but they're advantages to the average Joe that hasn't learned, hey, we can work on this. 